Welcome back. Joining me now are coaches in our community with a commitment to providing a safe space for our youth. Welcome, Daniel and Daniel. Hi, Thank guys. You. Thanks for joining me. Thanks for having us. Why don't you start off by telling us about Unit Promise and the mission? So the Unit Promise is a nonprofit. It's a 5013C. Yeah, um, our goal is to just provide transferable skills to our boys that they could use both on the court and in their lives just to be competitive, um, be respectful, be accountable for themselves, and um, to be become great young men. What do you think sets Unit Promise apart from other youth sports programs? Um, I think just concentrating on the whole child and their purpose, both on the court and off, um, for all the young men basketball ends. So for them being able to tap into their purpose and getting that love um, and finding out what they're truly built to do, I think sets us apart from everyone else. We tend to start kind of really early, um, and so we try to install accountability, mm -hmm. um, not only on a basketball court, but in the classroom. <clears throat> so we do a lot of grade checks and, and kind of reward the kids on positive behaviors, mm -hmm. um, and then also make them uh, be accountable for negative behaviors. I really love this. We always talk about different sorts of youth programs, and not every child is going to go to the NBA right. or the WNBA, mm -hmm. and that's okay. There's so much that you get through these programs that go such a long way as far as character development and a child becoming a leader, being a community member, being an advocate mm -hmm. for themselves and others. Do you want to talk about what you've experienced with your kids? Um, just being able to see them go through their whole process of at first wanting to maybe be a pro and then being exposed to different things that open their mind up to so many different areas that they're talented in and not even knowing. So just watch Watching them go through their whole process is a blessing. Now, you prepare your teams to be part of uh, tournaments and competitions. So tell us about what you've been involved in and been able to have your kids participate in. So over the last couple of years, um, we participated in a lot of high-level events, um, which kind of catapulted us to Adidas. Um, we now are on the Adidas Gold Circuit, uh, and that will help generally for our kids to be exposed to a lot more uh, like coaches and schools, um, but also um, the ultimate goal yeah. is let's get their education paid for, mm -hmm. and then you can find those purposes and what you want to do. So let's um, be great in school, great on the court, put it together, get college paid for, and then we are able and prepare for our life from there. Do you want to explain what this Adidas program is and what that means? So the Adidas circuit is a platform uh, basically sponsored by Adidas that the boys are able to uh, play in these events that a lot of college recruits and scouts are invited to and the top talent from around the country. So they're able to, you know, play against all these different people um, from different countries, different places, and compete in front of the school so that they can figure out what's the best fit for them. Very cool. Do you want to talk about how you prepare your teams for that level of competition? A whole lot of intense practice. <laughs> <laughs> you put those boys to work. Huh? Yeah. yeah. So, um, poor preparation leads to poor performance. And so, prepping and um, treating practice as if it's the game. So then when you get to the game, it's like a walkthrough. Mm -hmm. Everything in practice, we want to throw at them different life challenges, different basketball challenges. So then when you experience them, it's not something that's unfamiliar. We also use like film study as well. So kind of go over like games and stuff that we did wrong. A lot of times they don't always see what they did wrong till they actually see it on film and then they can like, you know, kind of view it and say, oh, I, well, you was right, coach. So mm -hmm. that helps a lot. For the visual learners. How can the community support your mission to help the youth? So we have a platform for a donation on our website. Um, and you can go right on to www.theunitpromise.com. Uh, um, and it's like a donation button to help uh, what many of different things we for traveling for uniforms for um, picture segments media when we go out of town um, even down to uh, for vans or uh, gas mileage you know, anything helps mm -hmm. one of the greatest challenges is figuring out a home to house the boys for both their academics and practices so um, using those resources to help us in that area is big the community um, is probably our biggest asset in order to, you know, help the boys be successful. That's right. It takes a village to raise a child. Absolutely. My dad's a basketball coach, so I know it takes a lot of money.
me. Um, but if you would like to support them or learn more information on everything they're doing for our community, head over to theunitpromise.com. Thanks again for coming in. Thank Thanks you. Thanks for having us. Daniel Squared. <laughs>